to get over a bad breakup, there's nothing much better than belting out the lyrics of a great breakup ballad. Songs about splits can rouse a good cry, for that much needed cathartic release, or fire you up to get out and move on. Sure, the post-breakup state of mind includes loneliness, distress, and grief, but research shows that your emotional health can be quickly restored if you are able to put a positive spin on your split. And that's where songsters such as Bob Dylan, Paul Simon, and Nancy Sinatra come in. Upload these 10 breakup songs to your iPod, and sing them loud. CeeLo Green's Rock Out Tune F Asterisk at KU, which he co-wrote with Bruno Mars and Philip Lawrence, or its radio-friendly counterpart, Forget You, scaled to the no. One spot of Billboard's Top 40 list in April, probably because so many Americans can relate to getting dumped for someone else. Once the cleaned up song hit the airwaves, people everywhere were belting out lyrics like I pity the fool who falls in love with you, including Gwyneth Paltrow on a Glee guest appearance. If your sweetheart recently flew the coop, this explicative written ditty may help you forget her faster. Sing this. Yeah I'm sorry, I can't afford a Ferrari but that don't mean I can't get you there I guess he's an Xbox and I'm more Atari but the way you play your game ain't fair. If Fleetwood Mac's Go Your Own Way speaks to you, it's because it was inspired by a real split. Guitarist Lindsey Buckingham penned this song after his breakup with bandmate Stevie Nicks. The tune came out in 1977, but when it comes to breakup songs, this one has stood the test of time. In fact, the song's cathartic lyrics may help you gain perspective on your own bad breakup, you, too, can't go your own way, and begin to stand on two feet. Sing this, if I cold maybe I'd give you my world how can I win, you won't take it from me. The Gloria Gaynor single I Will Survive reached no. One on the Billboard Hot 100 in 1979, but the disco favorite is still a top breakup ballad. The song, written by Freddie Perrin and Dino Ficaris, tells the story of a woman who starts out feeling alone and petrified after her breakup but gradually gets stronger as her self-confidence returns. The driving beat and rousing lyrics are sure to get you out of a breakup funk. Sing this. I spent so many nights just feeling sorry for myself you used to cry now I hold my head up high. There's nothing wrong with indulging in a little self-pity after a bad breakup, and few songs set as mournful a mood as Eric Carmen's All By Myself, a 1975 classic that's been covered by everyone from Celine Dion to Charisse on TV's Glee. Jamie O'Neill also sang it in the movie Bridget Jones's Diary, when an overserved Bridget, played by Renee Zellweger, is alone on New Year's Eve. In the breakup anthem, Carmen regrets his carefree attitude toward sex and relationships, which has left him alone and miserable. Perhaps you can imagine your own ex realizing the error of his ways one day. Sing this. When I was young I never needed anyone and making love was just for fun those days are gone. Misery loves company, and that's why the song I Wanna Be Around may be one of the best breakup tunes of all time. The song was released in 1963 by the great Tony Bennett and written by the equally great Johnny Mercer. It starts off sweet, I want to be around to pick up the pieces when somebody breaks your heart. Ultimately, though, Bennett reveals that what goes around comes around, ending with the words, like you broke mine. If you need a little companionship after your split, there's no one better than Bennett, who's still crooning this standard nearly 50 years later. Sing this, and that's when I'll discover that revenge is sweet as I sit there applauding from a front row seat and somebody breaks your heart like you, like you broke mine. Feel like you've taken the blame for a bad breakup one too many times? Next time, tell your ex to take a clue from Bob Dylan. The message behind his song It Ain't Me, Babe, written and released in 1964, is a deep self-realization that he's not right for the person he's involved with. Remember, going through the throes of a breakup now is better for your emotional health than holding on to a toxic relationship that won't ever really satisfy you. You say you're looking for someone who will promise never to part, someone to close his eyes for you, someone to close his heart, someone who will die for you and more but it ain't me, babe. The best breakup strategy? It may just be to rip off a bad relationship like an old band-aid and get yourself free. That's what Paul Simon sang about after divorcing his first wife back in 1975. The up-tempo breakup number, 50 Ways to Leave Your Lover, is still Simon's biggest selling solo hit, and it's complete with plenty of suggestions for splitting up. Sing this. You just slip out the back, Jack make a new plan, Stan you don't need to be coy, Roy just get yourself free hop on the bus, thus you don't need to discuss much, just drop off the key, Lee and get yourself free. Sometimes, the best way to get over a breakup is to vent, and vent loud. 
Alanis Morissette co-wrote the Grammy-winning song You Ought to Know with Glenn Ballard in 1995, and it was the first of many chart toppers from Morissette's emotionally charged album Jagged Little Pill. Through her lyrics, Morissette takes the opportunity to let her ex-lover know about the mess he left behind. If you have some unresolved anger you need to unleash, this is your song. Sing this, and every time you speak her name does she know how you told me you'd hold me until you died, till you died? But you're still alive. Nancy Sinatra's feminist anthem makes it known that she's not going to take any more abuse from a guy who's being unfaithful to her. Singer and producer Lee Hazelwood wrote the song in 1966 for himself, but realized it would be more powerful sung by a woman. Released at the start of the women's liberation movement, this breakup song remains inspirational even today, over four decades later. Sing this, you keep lying, when you ought to be truth and then you keep lossin' when you ought to not bet. You keep salmon when you ought to be chongin'. Now what's right is right.